Hey guys, what's happening? Uh, down here at the river trail, it is a Thursday night. The snow is coming down like mad. Check this out. I don't know how much you can tell. There's like how deep it is. I don't know, three, four inches. Me and Booger, or no, sorry, I have snot out this evening. That's how deep it is. Those are two, two chisels. The bumper is raised like over an inch from its uh, factory position. Well above the frame, the frames in the snow. Anyways, it's just me in the truck. Again, I'm gonna try this. Maybe make it out to the rocks this time and uh, get more and better footage than I did last time. I think last time I just mainly just did, I think the logs and a couple of little hill climbs here and there played in the snow, but I'm gonna go all the way down to the rocks and see what I can get. Uh, Ted just texted me that he's out. See you again, old man. I've only made it a few feet from my Jeep and uh, yeah, already I've been, I hit this stuff and man, yeah, it's just plowing. This is awesome. I love to challenge the truck, right? I hate going out and just touring. Look at that plow. And I, yep, I'm having trouble getting up this, uh, this is one of the things we usually hit and just do a nice little slow crawl up it or whatever for, you know, fun and footage and whatnot. Yeah, it's got a lot of snow. There's no slow crawling into the deep stuff. You gotta just plow it. We need Ted's big heavy bitch here. Tatanka. Hey guys, pretty sure, uh, well, saying hello again. Anyways, uh, one of the hardest things about, I love the snow and I love the fact that it's snowing while I'm out because I just love the look of the snow like that. Snow. Um, this is one of the hill climbs that we constantly hit. Uh, it's been untouched. I haven't, clearly I haven't done anything with it yet. And uh, check out the lights on the truck because it's still just plowing through stuff, right? Like I still have to give it a kick every now and then and I'm on flat ground half the time. It's just bitching. So anyways, I'm gonna try this, and I'm pretty sure I'm not gonna make it, but well, I gotta get something half-ass entertaining, right? On my way to the rocks. Hopefully they're doable. Hmm. I need the penguin. Ain't going well. I'm on trail. I'm on flat ground. <laughs> I'm pretty much stuck. This was a night for the summit. It is deep. <laughs> I wonder what the rocks are going to be like. so much light. I don't see a moon anywhere. Anywho, yeah, finally made it to the rocks. A little bit scary to walk on because if I go down and hurt myself, I you know, break a hip or something, you know, I'm getting old. It's gonna be bad. Wicked. Front weight. Oh, 
shit. Lost front end. Uh, I don't want to fix anything out here. Shit, shit, shit. So I think it's just, I think it's just a grub screw anyways. While I'm in here, I'm going to change the bat. And uh, I just wanted to give you guys a quick look of uh, how much snow I got in there. I got zero protection on stuff. That's uh, a dipped AE2. The parallel plug for the uh, front and rear lights and the underbody lights are all run by that little three cell that's packaged in there. And then uh, 35 turn Tekken with the 85 tooth spur and 20 tooth pin. Pinion. Uh, 5000 ma Venom. It's not dead yet, but I'm going to change it anyways. I've been running for, I don't have a watch on, but I'm guessing about half hour, 45 minutes, but in the cold and plowing snow constantly, that sucker's dead. Anyways, hopefully this is just a grub screw and I'll get some more footage. Yeah, it was just a front grub screw. I didn't Loctite it. I just snugged it up. Hopefully it lasts. If it comes loose again, I'm going to either Loctite it or throw it on the backpack and get the hell out of here.